go ahead. So since the abrupt decline of Arctic sea ice in 2007, the summer North Atlantic Oscillation has been persistently negative. Uh, people tend not to look at the North Atlantic Oscillation in summer, but we found that um, since 2007, for now six years running, the circulation pattern over Greenland is bringing warm air up from the south. This is more, more south air than, than normal. That's what the, the negative NAO is doing. Um, it's, there's a high pressure ridge that's also keeping it clear skies over the ice sheet, maximizing the potential uh, solar. Um, so the heating is lowering the reflectivity of the surface. The, the high pressure ridge is maximizing the solar energy. And because it's clear skies, that means it's not snowing and that would brighten the surface and, and limit melting. So that's already a one, two, three punch. Um, but there is another punch, is the wildfire, um, that, that at the same time that, you know, that's bringing in smoky air from the south, um, presumably depositing it on the surface. Now we need to get to the field to confirm that, but we, you know, it's very compelling evidence when you see the smoke cloud actually in contact with the surface, according to the satellite measurements. Um, so that, that's these, these multiple punches, you know, the ice sheet's just being pummeled um, by, in a way, circumstance, but it's, it's, it's climate warming that has produced this decline in Arctic sea ice that appears to have shifted the Arctic circulation system since 2007. And I, I, it's my impression that it would, we, it would require bringing back the, the sea ice and cooling down this, the Arctic um, to extricate um, uh, the, the Greenland climate from the situation that, that all these factors uh, just are, are, are combining to maximize melting.